<laughs> oh, hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Stubbs, H, Ban, and Zoo of Zoo Reviews. Uh, we're here with Retro Handhelds, and we are here end of year 2023, and we're going to be talking about our top 10 ultimate best handhelds of the year, okay, that are used to play retro gaming, and uh, we have quite the show in store for you all tonight. So uh, strap in, grab a hot cocoa, and uh, we're going to be talking about a whole bunch of handhelds. Guys, how you doing? Doing great. Good. Doing great. Um, so here's how we're going to structure tonight. Uh, we're going to list every relevant handheld of 2023 in a rapid fire lightning round. Then we're going to be using fun sound effects provided by Zoo to knock them one by one off the list. And we're going to be consulting with you guys at home, the live chat. And then we're going to be debating like an old married couple about the top 10, what rank to put them in. And we have a nice tier list that we're going to be sharing. Uh, and finally, we're going to be announcing the best handheld of 2023. Let's take a look at the tier list. So we have a top 10 tier list here. We're going to be dragging these pictures. And here are all the contestants. If you want to know what they all are, as well, it's in the description of this video. Uh, but all the ones that we thought were relevant to being a, a handheld winner for this year is in this list. And of course, you know that I'm making my case for Retro Chicken. So just be prepared for that. So without further Best delay, family. let's rapid fire through our various contestants who want to duke it out here. So we have quite the job in front of us, everybody. So what do we want to put at number 10? Pocket Air. I thought so. I, thought I would. I would say the Pocket Air is a solid well, number ten. Yeah. Which what one? The Arc. The Pocket Air. What no, about no, the I'd Arc? The, is number I'd put 10. The no, I'd put the Arc above that. He's. he's you put the Arc the above the Pocket Air. Four. Dare you? How dare you? See, I was gonna arc, wait. Get Arc out of the corner. We can always move the ones that we know are. Okay, you're, let's just. Up. Should we just sort of generally get them where we think they go, and then go from there, and then move them sure. out? Okay. Oh, I was just going to say, you take the ones that aren't 10, move them up to 9 at least. True. I like this idea. Ban. Wait, no, no, no. You... I, what? That's why they pay you the big <laughs> beans. No, 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 no. Flip that. What? what? Put the pocket what? air down there. It seems fine. Oh, yeah. dang it. So close. Yeah, I I love the pocket air, but I don't think it's any higher than It's 10. not all about okay. power. It's not all about, like, which one can play the most systems? There's a, We've learned, especially this year, there's other things that make a good handheld. If the reason the reason I like the Pocket Air is the same reason a lot of people like the KTR one. It's 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 right for them, but I know that it's not right for everybody, and I ju I just know that. So the fact that it's even on the top ten list right now, I'm happy with. So I accept tenth place. If they put that screen on any of the other handhelds on this list, that yeah. would just make it way better. Yeah, Arc above Pocket Air, H gets it. Yeah, fair. Ninth place, I think the Arc is ninth. Honestly, uh, yeah. No, I, I take it. I, I I put it at least one spot higher. You think the arc should go one spot higher? Are you that, mad? I know. Have I, you I lost be, your damn mind? I would be okay mind. with it's the niche. RGB it's 30 niche. staying at ninth. I would be okay with the RGB 30 at ninth. I think RGB I would pick 30 the, at ninth. I would pick the arc over the RGB 30. I think the RGB 30 has more of a use case than the arc. I agree. Scott, I thank disagree. You. The RGB 30 made me want to play Game Boy games. The arc made me want to play a bunch of arcade and fighting systems. Sure. Whoa, 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 whoa. The other day you told me RGB 30 is great for SNES and NES. I did and too, and I stand games. by that. Zoo you, Zoo, you need to really just try it. It's great. And now you're changing your tune. I don't, so, I don't, I, I don't I like this. I did it. I just argued the arc should be higher. Hey, where's the Moon Mini Plus? Ah, oh, crap. Oh, Do sorry. we not have a picture for it, Aish? Did, did I, I miss it? Did I just, not upload it? Just use the do. One oh, here. wow. I did miss it. Give me one second. Let me let me correct uh, this. It's what do we have in there that shouldn't be there? The pocket air. So like. Oh, this is deserves I, at least 10th place. Come on now. You can move the Odin up. You can move the ally up. But I don't think you can. We're going to we're going to add the uh, the Mew Mini Plus. That is our bad. You think RGB 30 should stay at ninth? OK. Wait, no. Something needs to go out, though. Arc yeah. goes on ninth. Something needs to no, leave. Something needs to leave. We have yeah. 11 images. Damn it, guys. All right. Pocket air. The. the the pocket air goes okay in this Everybody list pocket agreed? air is gone fine pocket yeah. air is gone are you all happy now are you all happy Actually, at home? yes i am i'm drinking i've never beans. been happy fair at least we didn't have to fight in vietnam I now mean, what but, do we but, do but, next okay goodbye pocket air you're going nope. off yep it's out 
It's out. So, Stop. what do we want to put down there? RGB what? 30. I'm okay with the RGB 30 being put there. The arc at 10. What? You want me to fight for the pocket air above their beloved arc? Put the RGB 30 at 10. The arc is at 10. Wait. No, RGB 30 at 10. Why do you think that the RGB 30 should go on below the arc? Yes. Because there's more use cases for this. This is the, the most unique handheld we got this year. Here, that has a square screen, but everything else. I is bought like a one handheld. from amburnick.com on my own, okay, just to get the black color. And you, you want to know what happened immediately? Yeah, that's, that's a user's error. No, no. That's... I put on the screen protector ever so carefully. Look what happened. One second in. How many screen protectors do I apply in this job? Okay. I apply hundreds of screen protectors. I think protectors you've been going a, a little too hard on hundreds. the stubs. No. I mean, do I do more pressure than the average person because my thumbs are freaking huge? Sure. Why not? Have I ever done this to a handheld before? No. Look at this. You smashed Terrible. the screen with your thumb. Terrible. That's not the Terrible. beautiful handheld's problem. But can I play this? Can I hook it up to HDMI? Sure. I think the chat is behind me on this one, that the arc goes above the RGB 30. That's yeah, yeah. This, this is this is my argument. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better uh, D-pad, probably the best D-pad. Some of the best buttons on any handheld. You Much guys are smoking to use. crack. Listen, better listen. shoulder buttons. No, I don't. No, I don't. Just, just get me on the other channel. Can I? Can I recommend something? What? Just, what if we tell, put, tell Russ. Tell Russ. I'll do half the videos. Flip at ten. Just listen, Zoo is quitting the team right now. He's literally calling what? the other YouTube channel. He's literally no. making the call. We told Zoo. I thought you weren't gonna go with another channel until you got yours. No, I no. That was that was uh that was uh, DoorDash. Okay, fine. Wait, there we go. I'm okay with that. Everything you can leave the arc at nine. Yeah, everything else can go up there. Oh, you think? No, flip it, no, I don't think. No. I don't think so. Oh yeah, so. dude, the no. hinge. Case exhibit A. Yeah. Exhibit B: A normal blah, human blah, blah, being blah, blah, that doesn't have super strong thumbs. Blah, 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 doesn't blah, break blah, everything. Blah, 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 I blah, have blah. my flip, and I never broke it. I think, considering the software issues, the RGB is a solid ten. What if you're I like what happens. Handheld. Look what happens. Look what happens. Mess around and find out. Wait, don't happens. break your stuff. This isn't yeah. my stuff. Someone sent this to me for the giveaway, and I said we can't give this away. It's all flip, 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 flip. Yeah. The you need to get it now. The fix man to the, the Chris, the fix it man at Retroid. Look, I use my RGB 30 more than the flip. You, are, and I you can, guys are and, ridiculous. I'm a strong I, daddy that is not my fault. Wait, and what? I can completely agree with the RGB uh, 30 at 10. And I use it more than most other handhelds, but I understand it. The, the software has issues. There's not a whole lot of support, and it's a little bit more niche. It's a solid 10. Yeah, All right, fine, solid fine. 10. RGB 30 at 10. 10. Yeah, yeah, solid 10. Flip solid 10. Flip. We can all agree flip is the 10. No. No. Flip. Yes. No. Flip, flip is at least a 7. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, at the lowest, worst case scenario, the flip drops to number 7. What? What is 10 then? What's the, the consensus? RGB 30. RGB 30. You guys yeah. are you guys are all arc smoking nine. bananas. The arc arc nine. is no. 9. I'm okay with the arc at 9. I would say the 2S at number 8. Whoa. Oh, those. 2S at number. You're going to put the 2S below the freaking flip are you crazy actually no are Wait, you, you know crazy what? Say, i would right say now. four or five m at number eight all right it's too no. heavy what it's, it's too heavy it's the d-pad's in the wrong the d-pad's in the it's wrong spot I, I would heavy. put the four or five m below the flip and the 2s it's premium i'm willing to now I mean, which Kyle, one Kyle would i right. would rather use i would uh, rather use the four or five m versus the 2s but i can see an argument made for it on number eight. We're still ignoring the the Miu Mini Plus, which shouldn't be this high. That's oh, you, not what the community says. The community says it should be like number two or three. Community yeah. is nonsense. We voted it number five in best overall. Are we going to listen to the community? We're going to listen to our hearts. What I'm what hard. we believe so inside. Far, I didn't hear hearts. any of you argue that it should be any lower up until your eyes. Point. Strong hearts can't lose, Stubbs. I, put, okay, put the Miu Mini at eight. This is a disaster. Um, yeah, I think the arc should still go number ten right now, personally. I'm having a hard time backing down from this. I do agree personally. No. We think we should vote. I think we should vote on it. Make, Let's no, get a make vote. An argument. Make an argument. Convince me, and I'm fine with it. Because the you? chat is behind me. The chat was behind me. Chat I chat has power I, here. I didn't take debate class in high school. Chat has I, no power here. I I I did rock and roll where we do things with our feelings. Sorry, chat. Okay. I'm really no, now, I'm, I'm gonna say that's fine. RG Arc, besides my unit being all destroyed, if um it is, uh, it is, uh, screen's pretty good. Okay. The D pad. Yeah, it's good. Uh, however, I don't like it as much as I, as I the do the RGB 30. So Sega games on the arc is better than the experience of playing 
one by one aspect ratio games on the RGB 30. Pico 8. Pico 8. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Pico 8 Game Boy. That's the two best systems that, well, Game Boy Color that you can play in the you RGB 30. I believe how highly Aish was praising the RGB 30 to me yeah. yesterday. He was. I still am. This is a top 10 list. This is the 10 it, best hands There are the year. green, yellow, red, blue, purple, white, black. Will I go? Shall I go on? How many color Bye, options Joey. are there for the arc? Seven. Wait. Bye, Joey. Four. It's been good. No, I think this is good. I don't know why we're okay. still arguing about ten All and right. nine. I'd say that's solid. Okay. Wait, can we vote on it? I say I say that RGB thirty should be ninth. Agreed. Oh, oh three of us. I three of us. Fine, fine, whatever. I, I in my heart it's flipped. Okay. We'll come back to it if we have to. Once again, okay. Sega gets I will, the short end of the stick. I will say that Mew Mini yes, Plus could be at eight. But no, dude, guys, come on. The, the the flip should be on at eight. I like the flip. I, it's the only clamshell. It is. Yeah. All right. I can just I can just put it in my sweatpants. Ana analog is, triggers. Is, is that, does that make it handheld around. of the year? The no, it makes it, it hand best? number no. seven out of ten. I, yeah, I, I think the flip is better than the Mini Mini Plus. I'm gonna make a video after this that's called Stubbs Tops Ten Top Ten. I'm gonna best. make an, fine because it's gonna be an entirely different list. I'm gonna write an article about this. Yeah, this there Good, needs to be reparations for this. This is untenable. I would put the flip above the 2S personally. I wouldn't. I would. <laughs> if you have the 405, sorry, the the flip closed, it's the same size as the 2S and it does everything the 2S does but better. Joey, flip is 8, did. Mew Mini is 7. I feel like the Mew Mini Plus should be above the flip though. Oh man. I'm just the, saying, Nate, what one thing that the 2S does better than the flip? 4x3 screen. Pocketable. Six. Smaller. They're the same size. No. It sticks oh. are way better. 4-3. 4-3. 4-3. 4-3 yeah. aspect ratio. Sticks and D-pad. D-pad. D-pad placement. See, sticks. I know where my RP2S is. I have no clue where my flip is. The flip has True. Sliders. I don't even, I don't even own difficulties. a flip for myself. The flip has sliders. They're the same size. Dude, the flip is so good. The flip has a broken hinge. Look at it. Not mine. I have them ready. They're the I'm same size. Same size. Okay. I'll allow. I'll, I'll, I'll say I don't think Mew Mini Plus should be eighth. That seems wrong. I think, uh, yeah, I'm okay with it being higher. But I, I think no. Flip I, on eighth. Flip is eighth. Two, uh, two S at eight. We Whoa. all agreed that the 2S was great, Zoo, but it was a little Zoo, too can late. You, Zoo, can you take your Nox? Because I took my Nox. Dude, we don't even have, I don't even have my precious pocket air on the list anymore, thanks to all this. So I mean, we could get rid of the Steam Deck. There's too many QA problems. We can't get rid of the pocket Steam Deck. You know air. what would happen? People would track us down. Many of our addresses yeah. are available who yeah. who bought from us. I'm still and they will, waiting to hear they will come to our why the 2S it. goes above the flip. No, nobody's made a good argument. That's it. It's four by three. It's ninety nine dollars ish. It has better no, it's buttons. Not. You it know has it's better not. sticks. It has a D pad. Come on, come on, come on. There's like seven arguments right there. Did you hear them? I'm not sold on it. Those were. I mean, hey, can we leave it here for now? Can we come back and fight about the final little fine, details later? Fine, okay, fine. Let's leave the Mew Mini Plus at seven. Okay, Mew Mini up for real. Mew Mini stupid, Plus stupid live stream. Mew <laughs> Mini Plus. I can handle at seven. But you know yeah, what? That's one of my favorite D pads. Can you tell I mean, me honestly that really you good. think? Can you tell me honestly that the 405M should be anywhere above seventh place? Though that's the thing. That's oh, what I'm saying. No. Yes. Oh, about that. It's no. Easy. I can't. I can't make that argument just because the D-pad's in the wrong place and it's metal. I wish it was plastic. All right. I feel like the 405M should be seventh. I, I can't. Right? I can't. I can't. A good conscience. Conscience. Uh, put a 405M above seventh place on this list. That's you're fine. Hot. I agree with that. I you're agree hot. with well, that. You're going to have a 405 m underneath the MiU Mini Plus and the 35 X. I'm talking Plus. value. I'm talking raise. Uh, yes, I would too. I would. Yeah. I would put the them well, just because of how expensive like, it is. But we gave we gave it to Zoo. The beautiful but we, screen. But we gave we made Zoo uh, eat, eat his the bana is bananas on the last you, on the flip. So we can't do it to him twice. From where? Like if you flash gamma, sure the screen is really nice, but if you just get it from Ambernick, it's over sharpened. The screen isn't great. All right. <laughs> four or five M. Four or five. With your fancy M. glasses, maybe you can seven. notice that. That one stays at seven. Everything else can go up. Yep. This is garbage. This okay. is a garbage yeah. list. Yeah, that's fine. By garbage people that I don't want to be associated with anymore. All right, on to six. Mew Mini Plus to me no, feels I like would, a solid I would... six. Nope, I would actually, Thanks. and I'm. It, this hurts me to say this, but I would put the Mini Mini Plus ahead of the 35XX. You're crazy. That's what the, that's what the community yeah. said, but but no. Here's why. Here's why. So we have them as, as a package deal right now. The Mini Mini right. Plus has Wi-Fi. It has a good functioning custom firmware. You can get Red to achievements easily. It's widely adopted, and there's a lot of mods for it. 
right now the 35xx plus has wi-fi but it doesn't really mm -hmm. have support we don't have a good custom firmware option for it and we can't really make good use of that wi-fi so just for that currently i would have to say the mini mini is ahead of the 35xx why is it why is the rog ally still on here no well, wait a second Ally's solid Ally's solid uh, yeah okay uh, Ally's money solid. bags over there like well, well it's I not money bags you get open box for like 330 dollars no, there's a solid argument for what the ally is doing for Windows. Do you get wait? Actually, do you guys want to keep the ally at number six because of the SD card issues? Oh yes, obviously. Yes. Okay, ally is sixth. Yeah, like, only boom, because boom, of the, boom, uh, boom. We're well, moving on. Yeah. Goon, good. Oh. Should, do you want ally at seventh? I do ally at seventh to give Zoo his precious sixth spot for 405M. Sure. Would that make you happy, Zoo? I trade. I trade. Nothing these. would make me happy, but it would help. Okay, okay fine. There you go. Okay. Ally at seven. Just Ally's because at it seven. was frying micro SD frying. cards. Frying. It is killing SD cards. Everyone's data around the world is in danger. Yeah. No, the the Ally is awesome. Like the screen is really good. There's a lot of good things going for it, but the battery mm -hmm. life is terrible, and you can't really use a micro SD card reliably. Oh, uh, you mean like, you know what? Like, I'm, at this point, I'm I'm at this point, I'm ready to argue that the 405M should be ahead of the 2S. <laughs> It's going to get up to number three. It's somehow, it's just going to sneak up there. Yeah. Nothing, argue. guys, nothing is in stone until we get the list put together for our first run. Okay. Then we can do a final, like, nitpicky, like, let's, you know, here's your Hail Mary option. Okay, so since it's not in stone, since it's not no. set in stone, I say no, just put the no, 2S no. at six and move the 405M up. No. Okay. 2S? Oh, yeah, Zoo likes at this. Number six and put the 405M at number five. Guys, do we have a number six? For real, for real. Not I'd say lie. leave the 2S there. Okay, we're are we going to fifth with freaking 405M right now, guys? Yes, you can argue about it later. Okay. Yeah. We yeah. put, yeah. put 3.5XX right at fourth. No, no. The mini yeah. plus should be fourth. No. Well, let's put here's... them together. Do these are so, so here's my thing about the mini plus and the 35XX is Why? Yeah, the 35XX plus and the normal are bundled. And if you need the Wi-Fi... Holy cow. 405M fits stubs nubs. He's right. Yep. But okay, if, fifth it is. If you Sorry. don't need the Wi-Fi or the extra performance, I still think the original 35XX does better than the medium. Here's the thing, though. it's At this point, with the price and what's available, it's not really about whether you need the Wi-Fi or not. It's just the option is already there. You have and to the have... price difference isn't that big. Listen, I, there's I, only I, one thing to consider is that you have to have children's hands to enjoy the, the Mew Mini Plus. Don't forget sure. that the 35XX non-plus has been dropping down to as low as $40 on sales. At this point, with what's available for the 35XX Plus, I don't think it's better than the Mew Mini Plus. But I think the 35XX non-plus Guys, is great are we, value. Can I we don't think the 35XX right is better than the plus. Let's vote. Mew Mini Plus hey, for fourth. High. Mew Mini I'm Plus for fourth. For fourth. That's three no, of I'd us. Say, I'd say that's a, a way higher than the 35XX Plus should be right now. And, and I'm okay with that, but I don't think the 35XX Plus should be number three. I don't think there's enough for it right now. So you're saying 35XX... No good custom firmware option. He's focusing on the plus and not the original. Oh, yeah, oh, or focusing on the plus? Because well, if yeah. I just focus on the original, was, was, the Mini Mini Plus is the you, original. You are the one who said that we're combining them together into one package mm -hmm. deal, though. Exactly. And That's the what I'm saying. And the 35XX original still blows away. It's not away. better than the plus. Okay, yes, it's not better. Ergonomics-wise, it's better. That's my thing. It's got a better screen. No Wi-Fi. It has no Wi-Fi. There's no, it has there's, no Wi-Fi. There's, there's no good use for it. Why use it? Retro achievements, trading Pokemon. For camping. It matters for, for a lot of people. Wi Fi. Yeah. But it also right. doesn't matter for a lot of other people. All right, let's, You're right. let's do a final vote. Let's do a final vote. Okay. You're putting the Miu Mini Plus at four. Eyes? Mi oh. Mini Plus at four. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And Fine. The, the only reason I like I had that last change of heart at the very end is because of the HDMI out. Oh, yeah. I wasn't even considering yeah. that, that you can actually plug it into a TV. No, Joey. No, Joey, I I still agree with you. I think the Mini Mini Plus at this point is still better, but I, I there's no convincing these guys. They're I, in, uh, the community, the community opinion Amber matters though. Pockets, I see. I want to I want to have the community have more weight than our, than us. Honestly, no. I mean, that's they had their pie chart. This is us. All no. I hear is Amber Shills. <laughs> Amber that's Shills. That's hear. what they, that's what they say about us on Reddit. You know, they said that we're I the know. we're the place to go for the Ambernic shilling. Is Reddit still um, around? I guess so. Digged. I guess so. 
Yeah. Oh, guys, this is so tough. This is so tough. Hey, um, community should be banned. Dude, hey. Joey, the community is who said that the Miu Mini Plus is better than 3 of xx Okay? So yeah, they're not agreeing with you. the community. I am the man of the people. You uh -huh. guys are the elitist. Listen, oh, just, to, know, just, just know, to calm H know. down, I'll switch it. We're giving no. him too many... No, you already gave him nonsense. Many you, I believe in my heart that the 3 of xx is better than, than the Miu Mini Plus. 3 xx was a whole thing last year. It was a movement. We it saw was a revolution, but that was last year. In front of our eyes. No, that was last year. No, and the Miu no, Mini has garlic been a came force. out. Garlic came out what, like New Year's Eve, and has expanded through 2023. Do you guys not remember people like staying up at, like three in the morning just waiting for the opportunity? To get Artificial a scarcity is not a reason for it to be number three. But the plus is not better yet at this point than the Miu onion, Mini Plus. With wi uh, sorry, yeah, only with Wi-Fi is the better option at this point. At today's moment in time, yes, I agree. Okay, or a no, top ten of the year. Eric is right in this year. Yeah, Eric is listen, right. Listening to the community, this guy got I, lung look, cancer. I, I love Garlic OS. Here's the thing: I, I, I'm all on board with it. I can't wait for it to be a thing. But right now, as Garlic is versus Onion, there's no way you can pick Garlic over Onion. I'm gonna. Ace is oh, all God. over the place. No, no, Ace came up with this cockamamie scheme. To merge What's he the doing? two units together, dude. He's in and now big. He's, now he's disregarding them. Yeah, dude, he's he's in units, big Miu's got pocket. Got it to number four. He's he Daddy me. Miu. Respond to my emails. Aish, I I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings here. Aish is full of beans. Now listen, the three five XX. I think still personally, me and Zoo think it's it should be in three. three. So's ban. ban. So's ban. Ban. What do you say? What do you say? 35XX is way better than the Miu Mini Plus. All right, fine, Me? fine. Flip it then. Fine. Okay, just hold on. Just let it be hold known on, that hold I on. fought for the community. Hold on. The community gets two votes, I I believe. Ace, you get a vote. One, so I that's just three. And we get three votes. So I think this, I think it's, dude, I think it's, I think it's Gary, neck and neck tied Gary, for Gary fourth. Tied and we it. bring back the pocket air. No, 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 no. If you guys feel this strongly about it, that you want to go against the community wishes and what common sense would say fine okay what okay is community you're disregarding the entire year we had of custom firmware being built in front of our eyes we were able I'm to interact not. that's that's we, my no, argument you're talking about we're talking, talking about our perspective what I'm saying is, our perspective if, if is that garlic is that. was ready right now there's no way i would vote for the big mini ahead of the 35xx but garlic isn't ready yet garlic 2.0 isn't ready garlic 1.0 yeah that's my disregarding garlic, garlic one doesn't have wi-fi support What's you're you're disregarding HDMI out for these people? Maybe this is their only handheld the entire year, and they can now now it's a console too. Think about that, huh? HDMI, HDMI. Fine. Everyone fine, always fine. says, "Leave what it as is." HDMI. Fine, put it, put the put HDMI. the plus at number four. HDMI. Yeah, yeah, the HDMI matters. HDMI. I, I never use it, but I get it. I get it. There's people that want. That's fine. Number two. I agree with Rex. Odin, I'm okay with the Odin at two. I forget you put no, Odin I at one. You put Odin at one. I would put the Steam Deck OLED at number one. I because that one. But the Steam Deck and the okay, Steam Deck starts at what three hundred or so dollars, right? For the two fifty six no, no, for the L C D. Yeah, if you're no. sixty four gig L C D. No, this the the OLED starts at five hundred bucks. That's a pretty that's a pretty penny. That's a bit of change. I know. I, I know it is, but I think based on what it can do and and the battery life you're getting for the first time on an X eighty six device is more than worth it. The amount of things that opens up to you versus the Odin 2. I love the Odin 2, but sure. I just don't see how you can make the argument for it being ahead of the Steam Deck OLED. I'm listening, though. I, I, I'm I, 50 50. I, I would probably put What's Odin more? 1 just because the Steam Deck to me, it's it, it's not a dedicated retro so, device. You can play no, your Windows games can games better than can. on there. You can make it a dedicated retro device, though. You put yourself a Batacera image on there. You yeah. got your Jealous or whatever. I can make the 1X Player 2 Pro a dedicated retro handheld if I wanted to. Yeah, but it's not as good as the Steam Deck. It's better. It's just too expensive. That's what makes it not as good? No, Joey. There's the community support behind That's it, too. Right. How easy it is to actually get retro games set up and like in the yeah, mainstream for the, for the Steam Deck. I, I don't know, guys. I feel like... I feel, I feel the like... controller layout tells you that the steam deck Ups. is a better retro Ups. console ah. i completely agree with this statement steam deck did more for handheld scene than any other handheld yes but it did that last year Just to and it's doing it again for x86 i agree stuff thank you no okay no 
I think it's a clear top. It's hard to say which of these three is going to be number one. I feel like the Odin is one A and the Steam Deck is one B. It's just it's some buffer. Where okay, on which device would you rather play Super Nintendo games on the Odin two or on the Steam Deck? Odin two. Really? With that D pad yeah. placement and the yeah. sixteen by nine versus sixteen by ten screen? Yes. Yeah, because it's not a giant weighty handheld. It's not even that heavy and it's comfortable. Okay. Okay. So what do you guys think? Well, what's going to last you longer when you take it out of your house? Because the Odin 2 sips battery. And that Steam Deck, even the revision. Mm -hmm. You can get like 10 hours on retro games. Okay. Are you going to be outside of your house sitting for playing for 10 hours? Yeah. Perhaps. Are you? Perhaps. Well, maybe, what, what if what if I want to play, uh, I don't know, PlayStation 2 on there? Have a better time with the Steam Deck. What if I want to play Bully and I want to be able to do it for six hours? What if I want to play Oblivion? Why would you? I, want to... I would say get, get a. a Why would you not want to play PC? Oblivion? I think the amount of retro games you can play on the Steam Deck is a lot more than what you can do on the Odin. Is Xbox 360? Thanks. Not Scott. just that, but like older PC games. Listen, all right. I'm gonna take the mic for a minute. Let me just get the fighting music going. Uh oh. Okay, now listen. Well, obviously, we have three options for retro spot number one and two. We got retro obviously. chicken. We got Steam Deck and we got Odin. While some would say that the Retro Chicken should be number one of 2023, it came out in 2021. I simply bought it again in 2023, so it is out by technicality. Otherwise, obviously, it would have won. Now, we have the Odin 2, which many say is the best of the best for retro, but a lot of people use it for Android gaming. And Oh, the song is restarting. And then a lot of people say, you know what? This costs a lot of money, but so does the Steam Deck. Uh, however, the Steam Deck has sweet ass OLED and battery life to boot these days with the get the OLED model. Yeah, it's a revision, but it came out this year and it's hella good. Can I say hella? And Odin 2 is very, it's the best Android handheld of the year by far. It's the best Android handheld. But we're talking here today about the best handheld for retro gaming entirely. The Steam Deck can do everything the Odin 2 can do, plus x86. Plus yeah. Linux, it is the ultimate. If you're going to have one handheld for the rest of your life, you not only have the backing of that warranty by Valve, they'll fix it for you if there's any little problems. Yeah. They fixed like three of mine. They'll fix whatever yeah. you want. AYN's pretty good about that too. But listen to me, guys. Listen. No, don't restart that song. That was a, too much confidence. Um, But for reals, I think that the AYN Odin 2 deserves to be the best Android handheld of the year, but I think the Steam Deck OLED is the best handheld overall of the year personally i think so too i don't think i that's my thing there i don't think there's a good argument for the odin to beating the steam deck right now it's cheaper it has better battery life a it's not bit. that much cheaper if you're getting the same amount of storage on both of them okay, okay. if you go for the 512 steam deck versus the 512 uh odin they're pretty much the same price you go pound for pound you compare yeah. dollar for dollar donuts and dollars and all the different comparisons of dollars. Well, I know two guys that are in Gabe's pocket. That's all I'm going to say. I don't get, I haven't gotten one review unit, anything from Valve. They sent me if one Gabe replacement. Comes calling, my, I'll listen to whatever that man wants to say. And it's just I because would, would too. I don't like zoo. I don't like that you're perpetu like perpetuating a zoo. I don't like that you're uh, propagating. Uh, the notion that because you got a review unit that you would have any sort of uh, uh, affiliation or bias towards any brand over the other. I, I take offense. Um, I've, I've definitely stolen your fence on time and time again, and you keep having to rebuild it. And I'm sorry. It's just a little gaslighting joke. And uh, what do you think about this? Just to clarify this point, battery life is a factor and the OLED's battery life is so good that it's, Worth it. Like, if the battery life in the OLED wasn't that good, I would put the Odin on top of it. 12 hours. On retro you think, Yeah. You... How many people in the world are playing Mario on an Odin 2 versus a Steam Deck? Think about that. People who aren't even aware of our niche, aren't even aware of our community, or our channel, or, or Rust. Bias, people who don't... Recency bias. Because we're all... Desperately trying get, to cope that he spent all that money on the, the we're, brand new whoa Swole whoa 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 i have okay. no to himself and to his family that's why we we, we bought this. there we don't have christmas this year kids we got here's the, the thing i have both of christmas you eat dinner off the oled 
I have both light, of them. And it. whenever I grab my Odin 2, as much as I love the Odin 2 and I appreciate what this is doing for Android handhelds, I have the option right in front of me. I'm like, which one do I want to play this game on? Chances are I'm going to lean towards the, the Steam Deck. Just because it's a bigger screen, even though it's lower resolution, I think it's a better screen. It's a high refresh rate. doesn't really matter for, for, for retro games, but it looks nice. Sure. And Listen, that's kind of where what I'm going for. I would pick... Personally, my choice is Steam Deck over the Odin 2, as much as I like the Odin 2. Let's vote. Why don't we vote? Yeah. We're good to use, use old democracy. I who, who votes the Odin 2 for second place? All right. Ban, I was dancing. What was your vote? I was looking he at Zoo's he stare. He, he wants the Odin to win. Oh, who thinks that the Odin should be in first place? And what does the live chat think? Fair. We've been taking too long. Deck for win, Odin two deck. Can we just count these? Let's just count these. I got say right, deck. Say the word deck or Odin in live chat. We're just going to count this up. Just it's out of our hands now. It right. Yeah, the chat's going to decide this one. We got to we got to say end of the vote. Should we say end of the vote? Oh yeah, That's three, it. two, two, one. one. Bah, bah. Okay. I put that in chat to help. Thanks. Oh man. Oh, uh, the Odin uh, 2 wins. No, the Odin decided. 2. Oh, There's man. All right. Top retro handheld. Where's my mic? Of 2023. We have in the corner. You see. The AYN Odin 2 is the best top retro handheld of 2023. As voted upon by you the retro community and your your local uh youtubers uh guys reviewers uh retro handhelds this is the definitive list i'm okay with that now do we have any final like kerfuffles about the the rest of the slots I mean, I let's see it let's see it at a glance let's just zoom this out okay in 10th place no, no that's in. that's not right flip it Oh, he caught me. Wait a minute, really? <coughs> yep. Like that? Yeah. Okay, in 10th place, we have RGB30. In 9th place, we have RG Arc. In 8th place, we have RP Flip. In 7th place, we have ROG Ally. 6th place, we have Retro okay Pocket 2S. Are we just going to fight? Like, should we just leave it where it's at? Because I don't know that we're going to get better than this. Because we're trying, you guys realize we're trying to rank a list on our personal preferences mixed with some community uh, feedback and this is a really hard thing to do do we want to lock do All we right, want to lock fine. it in okay i want everyone to be happy but i think it's going to be hard here when we have no so you many can't make everybody happy. i think I'm we have okay to be, with list. i think we I'm, have to I'm be objective just... i think we have to be objective on every spot on this list i think that's the yeah. only way to go i, I can't otherwise wait. people are going to go crazy over this i just want to make it clear that if the ally didn't have the sd card Thank issues you. and some of the little details that it had it would be way higher it would be yeah agreed but, but we're not in that reality, are we? We're not. <laughs> Nobody is happy. <laughs> Every... This is a tough list. Like this is really tough. There were so many handhelds out this year. I'm definitely going to share my own thoughts of what I think the top ten should be. But I, I mean, in this nobody happy list, these are probably the ten handhelds that should be on this list. It's just that nobody yeah. can agree on where they go on the list. I mean, Odin two, obviously clear winner. Yes, I wouldn't say it's that clear, but okay. I, I'm okay with that. I, I think. <laughs> I think the Miu Mini Plus could go in third spot, but it's I not. It I, so I'd, I'd say we're awfully gracious putting it for a 405M at sixth, personally. I don't yeah. know. I don't know. So are we all agreed that none of us are truly happy with this list? Oh, I'm satisfied with this. Because I'm fine with it, but it, we may be reaching a compromise is the best we can do here. and We're definitely settling. Like, we're... <laughs> We're in the ballpark, you know. It's just the order of these handhelds right here, uh, and it and it could be who decides the order. So we got the final list here one last time. Odin two's first, Steam Deck second, three five XX is third, Mew Mini Plus is fourth, RP two S is fifth, RG four hundred five M is sixth, RG Ally is seventh, RP Flip is eighth, RG Arc is ninth, and RGB thirty is tenth. I. For all of you who disagree with this list, including us on this panel here, uh, rant in our Discord, in our comment section. Let us know your top 10 list. Let us know 
how could this be better? Because there's no way to please everybody with a list like this. Uh, we have some very, very strong, passionate community members. Us ourselves are, are very opinionated on these things, not even sharing the same opinion on the same team, as you can see. So mm -hmm. I think we can all agree that these are the top 10 handhelds of the year. And that's about as far as we can get. Uh, and thank you all for watching. Please do like, comment, and subscribe. If you enjoyed this live stream and want to see more, we do stuff like this all the time. Nobody knows what's wrong with us, but we're going to keep on doing it. And thank you again to our patrons. You are all so kind for being here with us and subscribing. Uh, until next time, this has been Stubbs with Retro Handhelds on behalf of these goobers saying take care of your handhelds, everybody, uh, and take care of each other.